the worker will only receive raw materials that have proper origin and meet the quality standard of customers' markets. The workers proceed to remove the tentacles and keep the tubes. The tubes are cut open, trimmed, removed any organs, bones, and skin. The workers carefully inspected squid tubes under white light table piece by piece to look for remaining bones, skins, intestine and other foreign matters. Semi-finished products are then soaked in clean water tanks with substances E330 and E331 at a concentration of 3%. Semi-finished products are weighed and put into baskets. The workers use knife to cut slice with weight of each piece according to customer requirements. Then, the workers use specific tools like rack to slit the semi-finished products, create a convenient way to use the product. Semi-finished products are held in basket for total of 5 kilograms each, respectively washed through 3 tanks. After washed, the products are put into the spinning tools to be dried. For roasted products, after drying, the products will be heated treatment by cooking torch, to make the pattern visible and the meat firmer. The products are then divided into trays, with numbers depending on customer's request. Workers arrange the product in tray, nicely and evenly. then packed in PA bag and put in vacuum machine. Products after putting in PA bag are transferred to the metal detection machine. Each product will run through the detector. After that, the trays will be transferred to the freezer to be frozen immediately. Core temperature of the product to reach targeted temperature of minus 18 degrees Celsius. The workers putting each tray into master carton and strap it. Boxing specification and information on the master carton must be full and comply to regulation and customer's requirement. All finished products after packing are stored in cold storage at minus 18 degrees Celsius.